Now again a short video about Guru. Who is a Guru? Guru is Jupiter. According to the uh, astrologers, Guru is Jupiter. And uh, who is a Guru in uh, real life? Uh, now there is a fad that Guru is different than a teacher. A teacher comes to the class and just teach. And a Guru can change your life. Uh, guru gives you life lessons. Uh, the, a Guru can be a teacher also. But every teacher is not a Guru. Now, my viewpoint is every teacher should be a Guru. Even you come to class for 45 minutes, 40 minutes, 50 minutes, 1 hour, you are teaching a subject and along with that subject, you should uh, you should be accessible to the kids so that they can ask a few questions about the subject as well as a few questions about uh, their life also. If they are stuck in finance, in a relationship or something like that, they, if they are stuck, they can ask you questions about those also. Uh, and if you help them by answering uh, you are not only a teacher you are a guru also and it's very good if every teacher is a guru also so i don't uh, follow that particular fact that uh, a guru is a guru is a guru guru is like uh, thakur ramkrishna vivekananda they are gurus thakur ramkrishna or something like that kind of people are guru sad guru they are guru and uh, the teacher who comes to the class and teach you, they are actually teachers. But in real life, all of you know that there are many good teachers who has not taught in the class only. They have taught in the class, but they have given you some preaching or they have helped you to come out of some troubles which has helped you a lot. Uh, and uh, they are good teachers along with good people. Now, planetary position wise uh, what is there are two kinds of gurus so guru with sun combo and guru that means jupiter sun combo and jupiter saturn combo so what is the difference between jupiter sun guru and jupiter saturn guru? jupiter is knowledge you know and sun sun is fame so if jupiter in uh, in the house of sun the person will get fame and definitely we have to check the astrology also but the person will get fame if Jupiter is sitting in the house of sun or Jupiter or sun are sitting together somewhere then the person uh, will definitely be a teacher or guru or it might be possible that by profession they are not teacher or guru um, but by nature they have a guru like teacher whoever is stuck in any problem they come to those particular people and uh, for suggestions and all and they give suggestion okay now if uh, what is the meaning of guru plus saturn so means guru can be sitting in saturn house so guru can be debilitated in capricorn saturn house guru can be in aquarius or guru in jupiter and saturn can be sitting together somewhere okay so that is guru and saturn example so guru and saturn example is more practical Guru and Sun example, they are more famous and they are less practical. Means they may preach something they are not doing themselves. Be vegan, but they are not vegan themselves. Be vegetarian, but they are not vegetarian themselves. It's very good if you say truth, but they are not truthful themselves. It might be possible because it might be possible that uh, Guru and Sun are sitting in Capricorn. So that is also in some house which is not favorable for Guru, like 12 house and something like that. So it might be possible that Guru and Sun both are sitting in uh, Capricorn, then uh, house of enemy, and neither Guru nor Sun is comfortable there in, in a certain sign. So I am not talking about that, but yes, this combination of Guru and Saturn is when the person who is sitting in saturn's house can be aquarius can be uh, capricorn or guru or guru and saturn are sitting anywhere guru and saturn can be sitting in libra where saturn is uh, exalted guru and saturn can be sitting in taurus um, saturn's friendly house but guru is not friendly house so any place guru and saturn sitting together according to that planetary position uh, the dispositive it will give different results but Guru and Saturn together, most of the time, what happens or Guru in Saturn's house, whatever they say, 
they do if they are vegetarian only then they will suggest you to be vegetarian if they are doing practicing some yoga they will ask others to do yoga okay if they are doing some puja chanting they will ask others to do the puja and chanting but what happens if your guru saturn and sun are having combination means it is possible that guru and sun is sitting in capricorn then guru and sun both are sitting in capricorn means it's a combination of dispository saturn here so it's a combination of guru and sun sitting in saturn's house so it might have both the characters guru and sun sitting together so uh, and in saturn's house so they are famous as well as they are truthful they do things which they practice themselves so there is a more chance of being genuine now guru and uh, it can be guru and saturn sitting in libra then sun is not there but guru and saturn sitting in um, leo i have seen people who has saturn and jupiter sitting in leo so whatever they practice only they say if they are saying that that particular lady person who is having guru and saturn in leo is very 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 much laborious in like seva you can say service he she is very laborious towards in laws and towards parents they do she does much seva to everyone and she um, like ask other also to do so when guru and saturn are sitting in a sun house guru and sun are sitting in saturn house if guru and sun is sitting in aquarius it's really good i know one of my sanyasi friend who is having aquarius ascendant and guru and saturn both are sitting in um, leo he is also he takes care of parents not married definitely takes care of parents and uh, definitely sanyasi in serial sanyasi he does many things to serve the people in his field and all so these are the two combos i think it will be helpful for you and uh, about the dispositor again uh, if i see say that uh, guru and saturn are sitting together in uh, gemini then dispositor is mercury then it depends where mercury is sitting if mercury is sitting in saturn's house or guru's house means mercury is sitting in capricorn aquarius or mercury is sitting in uh sagittarius and uh, i see so this kind of it dispositor is also exchanging planet means guru in guru saturn in mercury's house and mercury is either in saturn's house or in guru's house this kind of exchange yes whatever you decide to do it, if you work hard that is possible it can come true so exchange of uh, planets in nakshatras exchange of planets in houses it helps to fulfill your goal okay i uh, i think it will help you bye have a nice day